Hey guys, welcome back. This is going to be the last step before this is transferred into the canvas. This step is actually very easy and all you're really going to need is a dark pencil. Now this can be an 8B, the darker the better. If you don't have a dark pencil, you could just use a regular pencil. However, it's a lot better if you use a darker pencil or you can use graphite, even charcoal. What you're going to do is you're going to take your image and this is one big paper I feel like I have, but you're going to turn it upside down. You're going to look very closely. If you get look closely, you can see the indents where the lines are. You're going to take your dark pencil, the darkest pencil you have. I'm going to use an 8B. And you are going to just color over top of the lines that you see. So you're going to do this all the way around on all of the lines until you're done. That's literally all you have to do. Once you finish doing that, we can move on to the next step. Once you have drawn over all of the lines, then it will be time to transfer the canvas. It's going to look a little creepy. And also make sure to check on the front to see if you got everything colored in. If you don't, then you need to make sure you thoroughly color over every line. All right. After you've done that, you're going to get your canvas. I'm going to use an, an 11 by 14 canvas. You're going to place it over top of your canvas. I'm going to put mine in the middle. And then you're going to trace over every line that you drew with any type of pen, pencil, whatever you want. You can even use a dull, broken pencil, any edge, as long as it doesn't puncture the paper. So you're going to trace this line. Make sure you trace every line. So I'm just tracing over all the lines. And you want to do that until you're done. Once you think you're done tracing, you can remove the paper. And you'll see your image has been transferred. It's a little hard to see on the camera. And if you think your paper moved or you mistraced any lines or you missed any lines, just go ahead and freehand. Right here, I accidentally forgot to do the lid, so I'm going to draw that in. And this is a little off. I'm going to fix this. And the eyes are off, so I'm going to erase this at the bottom. And I'll fix the eye. After you've done that, we can begin the painting. I like to start out. 